down there. You're on camera. No, this isn't God, it's a photographer. Hey everyone, Caitlin Henderson here with a She's Got Legs wildlife story. You may have just caught a glimpse of the off the charts level of cute you're about to experience. Yes, we're doing peacock spiders. Yes, they are too pure for this world. But before we dive right in, I just want to say welcome to the beginning of a beautiful and very weird friendship. Thanks to the launch of the She's Got Legs Patreon and its wonderful supporters. If you're watching this, I love you with all the bugs in my heart. It means I can make more videos more often, which for you means more tiny wildlife facts and more bizarre tangents more often. If you haven't signed up yet and you want to help bring more underappreciated heroes of the ecosystem into the spotlight, join at patreon.com forward slash gut legs macro. It's up on the screen right now or it isn't, depending on how awake I was during the editing process. And now for our feature presentation. Peacock jumping spiders, oh my god, just wow. This is Muratus tasmanicus, the southeastern coastal peacock spider. So just for context, these peacock spiders are so tiny. They're about the size of that grain of rice that gets like lodged in your teeth when you're on a date and you just can't quite, yeah. Different peacock spider species here, but you get the idea. This is the girl peacock, a pea hen. She looks like sand, it could be worse. Some spiders look like actual bird crap. But the dude, well, you're just all colors all the time, aren't you? He's got iridescent scales because he's a man of taste. He's a jumping spider, which means he's also got impressive acrobatic skills. But that's not why we've gathered here today. All right, my dude, hit us with your rhythm stick. This is how you ask a girl on a date in peacock spider language. The male raises his abdomen, extending hidden flaps to form a fan. He does mad splits with his third legs and dances for the female, hoping to show her that he is absolute dad material. Dance man, this is your moment. This is what you've been training for. Shake that booty, oscillate the epistosoma. Try not to panic and die. Who wrote this script? We're coming up on the end game now. He's approaching her, he's got the jitters, he's hoping she thinks it's cute. All right, everyone, he's going in for the boop. Expertly done, A plus booping. Okay, it's time to smash. No, that's not quite right. What's she doing? Okay, that's a no. He's hoofing it. This guy did not get the memo about respecting rejection. That is a clear no. Just stop. She's just tried to eat you. Are you mad? Maybe I called it too soon. He actually looks like he's doing okay this time. Ooh. Could be worse. At least males don't get eaten anywhere near as often as your dad told you. I'm often asked where you can find peacock spiders in the wild, and when I tell people, they give me that surprise Pikachu face. There's over 80 species currently described living throughout huge chunks of Australia, so chances are you've got some nearby. Depending on where you are, your best chance to find them is during the spring, and the professional technique is to stare at the ground. Very, very intently. So I hope you got a kick out of these little dancers. If you want to see more, like this video, subscribe, and leave a comment if you've got questions. And don't forget to head across and check out my Patreon, just like these fine invertebrates that you're about to see in the credits.